welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video today we are in the kitchen and we are going to be organizing and cleaning this entire kitchen it is so like messy and disorganized i think because i've known i've had this project coming like my refrigerator i haven't even bothered cleaning up my refrigerator so there's just like stuff a mess and it just needs some major organization so we have some groceries that I picked up on the way home today. I need to redo my spice cabinet. So I pulled out like the spices that I need to fill. They've been sitting there for like three days. I've got a Play-Doh thing over here I need to fix. I've got snacks. I'm, my plan, my plan is to move all of this stuff out, like the kids' backpacks, all this stuff, move that out of the kitchen, put it in the living room so I have like a little bit more of a clean working space, but. This is the second project that you will see of me organizing tons of stuff in my house. I have so many projects I am gonna be working on, so make sure you subscribe if you are new, and make sure you are following me over on the Instagram and TikTok. I'll leave all the information here, so I'll post updates and all that stuff on there as well. So, we're gonna get started. Let me show you what I bought. Let me gather it all. I've had like an organizing corner over here. <laughs> So let me pull all that stuff out. I'll show you what I bought to organize with and then we will go from there. So these are all the things that I have so far that I bought. I have a um, like a pot lid holder coming from Target that I couldn't get in store but other than that that is everything. So I bought this acrylic spice rack organizer. I'm going to move all of my spices to my shelf. I'm sorry to a drawer in my kitchen. I'm so excited about that. I got these for the kids. We, I'll explain a little bit about these, but they're just like those little water and juice cups. Um, they're reusable. I love everything reusable. So I got those and then I got these little organizers for underneath the bathroom sink. So I'm gonna give you a quick overview of the kitchen and of the places that we are going to be organizing. Austin's got the zoomies, he's like the dog. Um, so I showed you the fridge. We're going to be doing that. Um, I am going to be doing this drawer here and yes, actually Austin, do me a favor. Read for half an hour first, set a timer on Alexa and read. Um, I'm going to be moving all of my spices and stuff to here. We're going to be reorganizing this mess. Um, let's see. I need to clean up this drawer. It's a mess. Can't even shut the thing. And I need to clean up under here. I don't know if you see how dirty that is. Crumbs and just dust and dirt. I don't think I've honestly really ever cleaned it out. Um, I'm going to be cleaning out this Lazy Susan, reorganizing everything in here, cleaning it all out. I need to clean out this cabinet. It has like tons of mason jars and cups and all sorts of just kind of random stuff, honestly. Uh, this cabinet is fine, just has a few mugs and like our vitamins that we take. This cabinet majorly needs to be cleaned. There is just junk up on those two shelves, just a mess. So that is the plan. Um, this cabinet just has like our glasses in it and there's not many, the lighting's terrible. Um, there's not many glasses to even do anything with. I already have lunch. Yeah, but you gotta eat it in the dining room. Um, so there's nothing really in here that needs to get organized or done. Up here needs to be, there's like old, old, old alcohol. Like we don't really drink at all. We'll have like a beer here and there. I'll have maybe a glass of wine once every six months. But there's just some random stuff up there from like parties and stuff like that. Okay, then you need a haircut my dude then my goal is to have all of the food in here instead of having it in here and in here so because this has got to be messy again too so that is my goal just to keep things a lot more organized we're gonna do these three drawers 
Just the silverware. Again, it's not bad, but just definitely could be cleaned out. There's like some crumbs and stuff in it. Um, this drawer too. It used to be um, super clean and organized, but it's really messy. And then my towel drawer is not too bad, but again, needs to be emptied. And then under the sink is disgusting. Look at all that. I don't even know what that is. It's like coffee grounds or something, or maybe tea or crumbs of some sort. Maybe from, probably from Austin's birthday, the chocolate cake. But it is disgustingly dirty under here. Like, this lettuce, this bin, like, everything falls in here. Look at that. Cereal bar wrapper and a cheese wrapper. So gross. So gross. So. That is my plan. It's gonna definitely take me. In my thing, my school. I know, I found them and I put them in there. Oh. Can you not be naked? <laughs> I found them downstairs. So, that is my plan. This is definitely gonna take me a few days. Like, it is 2.15 in the afternoon. So, um, and the kids have a half day. So they were have been home for like two hours now. They have half day and, but they're in school full day tomorrow. So I will probably finish all this up tomorrow, but it will definitely take me a few days, but I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started. Things first, we're gonna start in here, empty all of this out and all of this. It 
attack Someone help me catch my breath again How did you stop loving me? How is that even possible? All right, that actually took a lot longer than I expected, but I am obsessed with the way it came out. Let me just use one of those organizers. I put all the bags. Like I said, we don't use these baggies very often, so I should actually probably just put these right on top. And we have some of the bigger ones back here. Um, we have a bunch more, but I think Kevin's got a bunch in his lunch bag, so we have a bunch of bigger ones. But these are all our small ones, but I mainly use these for the kids' snacks anyway. So then I have my foil, and then bye. I have some parchment paper, and I have these. I don't know why I have these. Honestly, I've had them for years. I think they, they probably don't expire, but I've had them for a million years. So it's like, I think I used one of them. So they're in there. And then my beautiful spice drawer. I have a couple of like my, what do you call this stuff? I just bought it, like chicken bouillon back there, um, a french fry seasoning, and another like just regular plain seasoning. So, and then I have the extra jars back there. But I love this. I'm so excited. I went through and um, organized everything. Um, I sent my friend a picture and she told me what was out of alphabetical order. She's like, I'm surprised they're not in alphabetical order. I'm like, they are. Um, but the garlic salt threw her. But um, that um, took so long. So, so long. So um, I also had a ton of seasonings that were expired. So I went through, threw everything away, made a huge mess in my sink. And this is literally full of all old spices. So, but this cabinet in the meantime is mainly kind of cleaned out. So I'm gonna move all of my pastas and things like that in this cabinet here. And then we're still gonna keep our peanut butter and all of that stuff. So I'm gonna work on that now. And then the other thing I wanna get accomplished today, cause it is already 3.45, um, I wanna get under this sink done. I don't think that will take that long, but it's just been really bugging me. So that is my plan for the rest of the day.
before we got lost and we parted back to back we would carry on and we'd do anything for what we started but this time we could break done with this and I'm so excited with how it's come out the only thing I just realized but I think I can fit it in I don't like that up there that's bothers me but I just need to fit this in and it fits in perfectly I mean I don't know what do we think is that it really doesn't matter I guess right um so this is all cleaned out but the rest of my kitchen is torn apart like there's trash there's stuff everywhere my cabinets are a mess I'm at my counters my cabinets some of them are a mess but um, I still have these groceries and stuff that I never even put away but I am done for today I wanted to get to the refrigerator but it is almost five o'clock like we we need to get some stuff I need to get dinner I need to figure out dinner um and I just need to like clean all of this up. So I will pick this back up tomorrow and I will do the fridge, I'll do the rest of the cabinets, I'll do the drawers and all of that. So I will see you guys tomorrow. All right, day two, we are going to tackle the fridge. So it just needs a good wipe down, it needs to be filled, it needs just better organization. So. My thing, I know I started to mention this yesterday when I was talking about these little reusable bottles that I got. My thing, I feel like you can buy so much stuff um, like off of Amazon, like organizing stuff. You can buy so many different bins that look pretty and that are this and do this and do that. And there's like always something better that comes out and this and that. I love, love organizational stuff. It is like my weakness. That and clothes love them love it love it love it but I also don't like a lot of wasted products I don't like a lot of wasted stuff like I was saying for these baggies to buy that little cute thing would look so cute here it would have taken up so much space and we don't ever use plastic bags like we have them we have a ton of them actually but we um I use like more the gallon size bags like when I buy meat in bulk and that's really the only time we use it. We use a lot of reusable products. So for me it has to like make sense and it has to save me money in the long run. I know I you have to purchase it but that's what I was thinking with these little things. My kids love the individual like things of juice. They don't drink juice a lot but they'll have like orange juice or apple juice in the morning or I make lemonade like the little packets of lemonade. So my plan is I bought a big thing of apple juice as you guys saw in my grocery haul video and I bought a big thing of orange juice. I'm gonna fill those up have those in the fridge we can fill they won't have waters with that because those are too small they drink so much water every day and they love ice water like ice 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 they drink yeah that like me it's like all ice and no water so we won't do ice waters in these but you totally could fill up like some waters self-serve they can go in get their own 
it's all done and these will literally pay for itself because they were like $13 on Amazon. You can spend that in one week, maybe two weeks worth of buying little individual bottles from the grocery store. So it will totally save you money and like the juice is so much cheaper when you buy it in bulk in like a big container instead of the individual ones. So Austin's calling me, he's home not feeling but good. So I will get started in just a minute. So all the food in here is good because it was just trash night so I went through everything the other day but I'm just going to go in and wipe everything down and reorganize everything. I at least got the fridge done <laughs> and it looks so good. I wiped everything out, just reorganized everything, our little juice bottles, they're so cute. So all of our eggs and produce and all of that and I used to have like the drinks all the drinks up here, like aside from the milk and coffee and stuff. Um, but I feel like when we put leftovers down here, they died in the back and we never ate them. So I found if we keep them up here, I see them better. I know to use them up. So that's my logic with that. It's not as pretty as having everything up front, but it just makes more logistical sense. So I have about half an hour now until Leighton gets home. So I'm going to do these drawers. I bet I can get to all of them in the next half an hour. So I'm gonna take all this stuff out, I'm gonna wash this down, vacuum out the drawer, wipe everything out, try to get rid of some stuff and declutter, and then it will be probably time to get her up.
traveling kind It's a known fact Yeah, I know that All right, my friends, we are on day three of kitchen organization. So today we are going to tackle this cabinet right here that's got like a bunch of glasses and mason jars and all that stuff, which I do use a ton of. But my main goal, and really one of the last like big things that need to get done in the kitchen, because I am on literally day three of this, not like all day, every day, because mom life, working life, all that. But is this bad boy it's a mess there's a ton of stuff in here it's just it needs to get like desperately vacuumed out wiped out it's just it's just a mess so that is the plan and I need to organize I did these drawers the other day which these are looking good then I need to do, I did this one as well. I did not get to this drawer, so I just wanna go in, refold everything, organize it, and then I want to go through this cabinet. So our glasses cabinet, I have my ring light on. <laughs> I filmed a cleaning video today. Um, my glasses cabinet and my dishes cabinet is like perfect. That's neat, organized, we don't have too much stuff in there. Everything's A-OK -okay in there, but there's a ton of stuff up there that needs to get gone through. So in my pantry, it's not bad. Um, it could always be a little bit neater, but we're working on going through all of our food and all of our stuff. Um, I don't know if you guys saw, I did a posted a video a couple weeks ago, uh, last week, um, about like my grocery shopping and doing all that stuff. I'm trying to go only every two weeks because we have so much stuff. So my end game with that is getting pretty much all of our food, excess food, out of here. I want all of it pretty much gone. Like if I need like a shelf for like some baking goods and stuff like that, like some extra flour and things like that, that's fine. But there's so much food in here and so much food like in that pantry. There's just really, really no need of all of that stuff. So. That is my goal today. I'm gonna work for like an hour. We have a crazy person who's addicted to video games. Uh, he's mad because I told him no video games today. Um, he played this morning, so I'm like, you're good. But anyway, um, that is my goal. And I hopefully I will get those couple of spaces done today and I will be done and I can show you my nice clean kitchen. I just, I scrubbed out the sink today. You'll, you would have already seen that in the cleaning video. You'll see that cleaning video that I filmed this morning before you see this video, but I washed the floors, dusted, everything's clean throughout the whole house actually. So that is good. But I wanna get those cabinets done, that lazy Susan done and organized so I can be done. And finally my kitchen is nice and clean. So let's get going. I'm waiting around for something real 
the deal Cause I want you to show me what you feel You're watching me like you want me But you're still holding back, still holding back Honestly, you're annoying me With the way that you keep playing Show me your love like it is, like it is And open my heart like you feel this alcohol even existed in my house. I know <laughs> I keep this vanilla vodka from when I make um, mudslides, but, and I also remember making margaritas, so I have a little bit of tequila in there, and I know I had Tito's. Other than that, I have no idea I had all of this. This grenadine is best by May 2016. Like, what is that? We never go up in this cabinet. So I'm literally dumping all of this. I have no idea if there's like an expiration date, but we will not use it. So it's just been sitting up here for forever. So I'm dumping all this. There's like a nice bottle of Merlot. There's champagne. There's Prosecco. Like, you name it. I have no idea. There's no dates on any of this stuff. And it's definitely five, six, seven, eight years old. This... This and this, I think, are at least 10 years old because I think these were here. I brought these here when we moved here, which is so sad. So I'm going to dump all of this and put all the bottles in recycling. Well, let me give you a quick little tour. You already saw all of this, the space cabinet and all of that. All organized. Then we have this cabinet, which we have our cookbooks up top. All of our rice, pasta, all of that, all of our sprinkles and jimmies and all that, and all our mix drink stuff, um, like hot chocolate mix, marshmallows, my tea, and some of those little like lemonade packs, our peanut butter and fluff. This cabinet, which has just all of our mason jars, my Yeti coffee mug, um, all like a whole big like serving set of wine glasses, excuse me, that my mother-in-law gave me, a bunch of china back there, and just a little butter dish that I have for decoration. This just has like vitamins and stuff in it, and then our coffee mugs up there. And then down here, it looks so nice, so clean, and all wiped out and organized. Um, I just went through and wiped down this shelf because this just has our pots and pans and there's nothing to get rid of there's nothing to declutter so i just moved everything wiped it all down and i'm using a bunch of pans because i'm cooking dinner um but then i wiped out this which was absolutely disgusting i don't know why just like tons of crumbs and then you guys already saw this that was done and clean so tidy i love it and then, oh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't do was this drawer. I mean, it's cleaned. It just has all of our towels in it, so I'm not too worried about it. But then we have this drawer, which everything is nice and organized. We have this drawer, again, nice and organized. And like I said, I didn't do anything in here because everything is already neat, clean, and organized. So um, same with this cabinet. 
it just has our cups in it so there's nothing really to do there and then up here you saw all that disgusting liquor and all of that I just have a ton of extra straws a couple of wine wines that I got for Christmas um, and like the people brought over and I have a couple of liquors that I make to make like margaritas or things like that there's I think three bottles back there I have a wine opener and our paper towels we don't ever use paper towels so that is all up there and I'm done Woo. that was up close and personal but I am done I am so excited it took me three days but it is done. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I have tons of more decluttering and organizing and all of that. So I hope you consider subscribing and I will see you guys next time. Bye.